All right, everybody, let's go! They're preparing for a battle. I'll find the old abandoned house near the edge of camp. Well, if they want a battle, a battle's what they're gonna get. We beat them last time with numbers. Would you need to... Yeah! Yeah! All right. yeah! I'm not weak, I'm just British. You'll never win. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Sophie Martileski, it's been three years. How are you? Someone saw you trying to train the counselors. Trying? I think I succeeded. Although, I guess that does explain why your campers are so prepared for our attack. I've been running this camp for three years without any problem until you arrived. Well, here's your problem, Sophie. Bring it on. CITs? Where did you come from? We've been here the whole time. We were caught in the middle of this. We weren't staff, so we weren't made slaves. We weren't campers, so we didn't try to take over. We just kind of hung out and waited for you guys to figure it out. 
three years later, here we are. And I think it's time we get this place back in order, shall we? Steve, Phil, I thought you guys were dead. James, we were using LARP swords. They're made of foam. Oh. We made Pied Side 7 tonight. This isn't over. So that was fun. Yeah, that was a good time. Oh, wait, what about the bomb? Just a small town girl Living in a lonely world She took the midnight train Going anywhere Just a city boy Born and raised in South Detroit He took the midnight